theoretical probability is almost harder to say than it is to calculate in some some situations because <laughs> the term is really big but the idea is actually pretty simple really all you're doing when you're finding theoretical probability is you're finding the mathematical likelihood of something actually happening so when we're doing that when we're trying to calculate the mathematical likelihood of something occurring we have specific terms that we use to describe the process. So I'm going to go through the definitions of those terms first, and then I'll describe the actual process, which is really very simple. The terms that we use uh, include event. An event is just the name that we ascribe to the action itself that we're trying to calculate the probability of. So if you're trying to you know, figure the chance of rolling a 2 on a 6-sided die, then the event would be rolling the die. So the event is the actual action that you're doing the calculation for. The sample space is the set of all the possible outcomes of the event. So again, in our situation with the dice, uh, for instance, the sample space might be uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and 6. Those are all the actual outcomes that are possible when you're rolling a six-sided die. It's not the number of outcomes. It's the actual outcomes themselves. Technically, the sample space is that whole set of outcomes. Now, you can you can refer to the number of outcomes in the sample space, and we actually do when we're doing the calculation. But the sample space itself is the actual outcomes that are possible. Now the desirable outcomes, desirable outcomes is the term that we use to describe the results we're looking for. So again, with the die, for instance, if we're looking to see how many, what the chances of rolling a 2 are, then the desirable outcomes would be a 2 in that situation. That's, that's the number we're looking for, or the thing we're, we're looking to happen. And then finally, the percent probability is that actual theoretical probability that we're calculating. It's the likelihood of the whatever desirable outcome you want occurring out of the total number of possibilities in the sample space. To calculate the percent probability, we just take that total number of desirable outcomes and we divide it by the number of outcomes in the sample space. So if we had uh, for our chance, say the chance of rolling a 2 on a 6-sided die oops, die, D-I-E not dead on a 6-sided die, well then the number of desirable outcomes would be just 1 because there's only one number 2 and then the number of outcomes in the sample space would be 6 because there's 6 possibilities on that 6-sided die so then we just divide 1 by 6 as a decimal, that is 0.16 repeating. And to find that out as a percent probability, we take that 0.16 and we multiply it by 100, which gives us 16.6, 16 16.7, 16 16.67% chance of that happening. So just take the total number of desirable possibilities divided by the total number of possibilities there are, you know, all together. And then once you get that decimal, multiply it by 100, make it into a percentage. That'll give you your theoretical probability.